Today we will be going to five different restaurants for the five days of the week and pretending it's our birthday and seeing what happens. It's a crazy video, make sure to strap your seatbelt in and get ready! Hey guys, my name is Taylor and my name is Kai. And together we are Twin Tube. And for today's video, we have a bit of a crazy thing incoming. A bit of a crazy video. So today's video is going to be quite an interesting one. What are we going to be doing, Taylor? So today we're going to be pretending it's our birthday in restaurants every day for a whole week. For a whole week. And that means it's a social experiment. Has it been done before? No, it hasn't been. It hasn't been. In Nanny Pat's word, that that's beat. Beat. that beat. As she said it, she said it perfectly. If you guys do enjoy this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below to join the Twinner squad. Join the family, why not? We're going to be doing crazy stuff like this all the time. Without further ado, we hope you guys enjoyed this video and let's get into it. Okay, so for day one, guys, we decided to take on one of the kind of most expensive restaurants in London and we decided to go to the Ivy Asia and kind of prank them and, you know, we went with our friends Tiara and Amelie and, you know, we called up and said it was our birthday. It is going to be very expensive. Restaurant one, the Ivy Asia St. Paul's. The Ivy Asia is one of London's most breathtaking restaurants with fine dining and we thought it would be a perfect choice for our first prank. It's my birthday celebration. We've kind of arrived. Hey guys. So after much deliberation and a lovely meal at the Ivy Asia with our best friend, I bet you're wondering, were we successful? And for day one, we was successful. We got that birthday and <laughs> they treated us so well. I'm actually so proud of us, I cannot lie. Okay, my verdict on dessert number one of the week is a four out of 10. No, it wasn't the best, so four out of 10. What's your verdict on your, your first birthday dessert of the week? <laughs> okay, what's your score out of 10? <laughs> Five. Why? Because <laughs> it was really nice and chocolatey, but it was a bit lemony and I'm not really a citrusy kind of person. <laughs> so as you can see, that was quite successful, wasn't it, Taylor? Very successful for the first trip. Come first trip. Come first trip. Come on. Day one. Successful. So we're going to try and see if we can hack four more days of birthdays. So let's go on to the next day. So today we turn 18. Should we turn like 19 for it? Yeah, feeling like 19. 19. 19. Let's get into Tuesday. Let's get into Tuesday. So for day two, we decided to take on what restaurant did we go to? TGI Friday. Yeah. It's kind of TGI Friday. Can you see mum in the back? Mum, give it, give it a little work. <laughs> Anyway, so yeah, we decided to take on the TGO. So we've seen the TGO, so basically they literally scream at people and say, happy birthday, happy birthday. <laughs> so we're gonna see if they do that for us. They might be a bit unfair, but yeah, they might be a bit unfair. Well, you know, you have to consider that there's two of us, Taylor. So we're not always gonna get like two, I mean, we could get two birthday cakes. Yeah. I'm, I'm hoping for a double birthday cake. Yeah, I'm hoping for a double, you know, we've seen their celebrations before. I think we should get the same reception, no? Huh? I think we should get the same reception. I get, no, what, I don't You know just what don't understand English, <laughs> I don't know what you're saying. Boy. I think we should just get straight into it. Yes. 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 So here's Tuesday. Restaurant two, we have TGI Fridays, Leicester Square. So we thought it'd be the perfect place as it's right in the center of London and we've seen birthdays there before. Food was quite the niceness though. <laughs> and then we started to realize that they forgot about us. We actually waited there for an extra half an hour. It was safe to say that was a flop. Um, they obviously kind of forgot about us. And do you know what? That is the first time I've been rejected. Yes. Imagine um, that happened on our birthday. No, but yeah, imagine if that actually happened on our birthday. So day two was an absolute failure. Yeah. You know what? Don't go to teach you that. Saturday, Sunday. So as you can see, day two was shit. Was a bit of shit. Wait, can we even sweat? Yes. Yeah, yeah fine. fine. Okay, so yeah, day two <laughs> was very bad. Same for us. This better, this better not happen again. This better not happen again, because, you know, it's kind of put a ruin ning 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 to the week. <laughs> a ning ning? Yeah, a ning ning to the week. A ruin ning ning, okay. So without further ado, let's get into Pizza Express. So for day three, we chose Pizza Express. Can you tell we're running out of ideas? The food was pretty nice, though. We got stunning happy birthday along with a little song. <laughs> what could be better? Happy birthday to you. Yeah. Oh, look, they wrote your name. Where? <laughs> so Pizza Express is great. Oh, lovely, lovely. My, my favourite of the bunch. You know what? They even sung Happy Birthday. 
It was really it awkward. Was, it was really really, good. really kind of awkward, wasn't it? It was so awkward. I think it was quite successful. Yeah, I think it was very successful. The man got, I don't know if I recorded it, but the man started like getting annoyed because I saw, like, they made it really obvious, but um, the waitress and the man who sang us happy birthday, the waitress was telling the man to sing happy birthday and he was getting pissed because he didn't want to sing happy birthday, but you know he did it. I'm so sorry you had to be I'm part so of this sorry. video. If you're watching this, I'm so sorry you had to be, you know, put through that. I say we just get into the next one. I say we're getting into We're on a good roll so far. What a fabulous roll. Okay guys, so now we're doing day four. It's day four, that means it's the penultimate day, it means we've got one day left. And so we're going to Wagamama's today. Um, okay guys, so I'm- Not even a tunnel. Uh, yeah. I didn't know Wagamama's actually did things for birthdays, but Kai rang them up and they said they actually do, so I'm excited. Anyway, I think it's time to get into day four. I think we're doing pretty well so far. We've almost conquered the challenge because I've one let down. Can you get the echo of the tunnel? Ah! <laughs> Sorry, that's a bit much. Subscribe to Twinty! Let's get into it! Wait, wait, the train! Let's get into day four, the last day. Come on, Mum. So for restaurant four, we chose Wagamama's. I'm not gonna lie, Wagamama's sell the best food, so it was inevitable that we were gonna go there. Ah, oh, see, look at that food. Oh. Happy birthday to you. And would you look at that raging success? Thank you so much. Happy birthday. What is this, please? Yes. <laughs> So day four was quite a success. Was a success. They kept Samuel ate all my cake. Yeah, Samuel ate the cake. Samuel ate all my cake. Um, I'm still reminiscing the cake and how I could have had the whole slice. I think it was very successful and I just think the last day is going to be even more successful. Yeah, the last day we have to go out with a bang. So day four was a success. Success? success. Ah! <laughs> anyway, so for day five, which was the last day, we decided we need to go out with a bang. We need to go posh. We need to go posh. So we're going to Sushi Samba. So we're going to Sushi Samba Covent Garden, where they sell the best cocktails, even though we're underage. So let's get into day five. <laughs> Mocktails check. Okay, so for the fifth and final restaurant, we decided to go to Sushi Samba in Leicester Square. It is right in the heart of London. So we want to see if we can get a luxurious birthday celebration. Birthday five. Are you ready for scam number five? It is the last scam. Were we successful? Yes, we were. So nice. So I think that was great. That was great. I mean, we've done the challenge. We've done it. You know what? It would have been great if we successfully completed all days. All but right. you know, we did go to the restaurant all day. So that's 10 points for commitment up here. Uh, so yeah, one day was a failure, but we made four days of success. So I want you guys to try out this challenge. I don't know if it's been done before, but Try out. Even if it's for one day, go to a restaurant and fake it your birthday because you know what? You get a free complimentary dessert and who knows you might get a discount off your bill. Plugged you off there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, we hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. And without further ado, we'll see you guys in our next. Free